Hey guys, welcome back to um, episode 8. This time is episode 8 of Everybody's Gone to the Rapture. Okay, so we, we just found out that Wendy's, Wendy's Stephen's mum. Um, and she's our new friend that's guiding us around. So, um, let's carry on checking out around here. We can't seem to get into any of the buildings, so I'm not even going to bother about that one. Nothing to interact with there. Looks like you can go further around that way. Is that where we came in though? No, this is. This is where we come in. So we'll go around the back. Let's go back the other way. <coughs> Excuse me. We'll go back around the back and see um, see where the archway goes. Oh, nice! Little pond here. It doesn't look like there's anything to interact with. The washing on the line. That goes to show how how um, recent events are. You could have still got washing on the line and everything. Really nice settings around here. I think that's it. I think that's all there is to see here. I can hear that clock dinging off again in the background. It's like a bit of a pathway here. Let's go check that out. I would definitely, if I, if I lived in this town, I would definitely live up here. Probably a good thing I didn't because they will disappear. So. Dinging's getting a little louder down here. Definitely getting closer. These are pretty flowers. Some old beaten down place. Doesn't look like we can go in there. So we're right on the outskirts of um, Yorkton. Half expecting zombies to come running at me. I don't think it's that kind of game. Okay. Well, here's the source of the ding dongs. I wonder if this is the tower that the guys were talking about earlier on. It doesn't have good things to say, so let's go check this out. Oh, what was that? It doesn't seem like we can open the door there.
Yeah, pretty sure this is the clock tower they were talking about earlier. Wait a minute. Oh wow, it's just the church. Okay, so that's that archway that we couldn't get to earlier. But so if we can get around this side, then surely we should be able to get through the door at least. Let's try that again. Nothing. So I wonder if there's actually much more to see from from where we went in the the front way. I'm pretty sure we I'm pretty sure we should have seen all of it. Okay, anyway, we'll go back this way. I saw there was a path there that we walked past. Um, coming this way. Something seems to be moving extremely quickly. So pretty. Look at that. Okay, so before we came up to the fence here, I'm pretty sure there was another path heading off in a different direction. Yeah, that way. Can get back over? There we go. We seem to be heading back over to where we came from, from Wendy's house. Is it? It seems a little off the beaten path. Okay, we can't go that way. Yeah, so this is this is back at the house. Back at um pretty sure that was Wendy's Wendy's house. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay. Well, looks like we're looking for a new area to explore. We haven't been to that house over in the distance over there. And we didn't go to that place. That was the first place we came to when we came up to this area. So... What should we do? I reckon we go this way. I reckon we go check this place out. See if we can get into the house. Look at that, everybody owns Portinas. Probably not even a Portina. I don't know. Here's a broadcast. I've gotta I've gotta see if we can get up the treehouse. Yes! Yes we can. Excellent. computer in the observatory has set itself to 607 a.m. June 6, 1984. I don't understand what that means. June 6, 1984. Okay. 
that was the time of the clock tower, wasn't it? If you remember, briefly, we checked the time. That's interesting. Oh shit, that's open. Here we go, 606. Okay, so all the clocks are set to 606. And the dates have been set to, what was it, 6th of, 6th of June, 1984. Okay, well, that was the timer, guys. So we've come to the end of um, this episode. So thanks again for watching. Hope you enjoyed. And we'll see you again next time.